If LSU football lacks anything, it would be the existence of a traditional, defined rivalry game. Since Tulane left the SEC in 1966, LSU has lacked a real competitive in-state rivalry game. With that being said, LSU has done a fine job finding other ones outside of the state. Rivalries for the Bayou Bengals have certainly been fabricated through certain eras. Some would say Ole Miss, others might say Arkansas, and others could easily say Florida or obviously Alabama. But in the realm of actual excitement, the Auburn Tigers have been by far LSU's most exciting SEC rival in the past 30 years. Auburn has not won in Death Valley since 1999, and when they roll into Baton Rouge with a 3-0 record, a lot will be at stake for both sides. There's, uh, there's more sense of urgency, a little bit more uh, uh, pick up in our step. It's, uh, yeah, it's, it's conference play. On Saturday, LSU will commemorate the 25th anniversary of the famous Earthquake game a game where Eddie Fuller's last-second TD put LSU up 7-6 over Auburn and actually registered as an earthquake on a seismograph on campus due to the 92,000 faithful just a few blocks away. LSU defensive tackle Anthony Johnson hopes for the crowd to be just as hyped for the 2013 game. Honestly, I'm just looking for these fans to come out 93,000 strong and just show love. Whether it's the earthquake game, the leverage call on a missed PAT giving Auburn's kicker another chance to drill the game winner in 2004, Another bad snap. Got it. The unbelievable catch by Demetrius Bird with one second left to preserve LSU's title hopes in 07 when a field goal would have been just fine. Or Cam's run to secure the 24-17 win in the 2010 game to keep Auburn's undefeated season and title hopes alive. And even last year's 12-10 barn burner on the Plains. The LSU Auburn rivalry may be one of the best rivalries in the SEC. It's certainly been the strangest. Johnny Lombardi, Tiger TV Sports.